What's up? It's BJ. Uh, if you guys haven't noticed at all lately, uh, the mainstream media, and not just Fox, but um, the mainstream media overall, like This Is Daily Mail, has been publishing a lot of Clinton bashing stuff. Um, I guess uh, premiered at the Cannes Film Festival was uh, the Clinton Cash trailer. I saw it online first, so if you haven't seen it, check it out. But it's coming out like the day of or the day before. Um, supposed uh, Clinton's nomination and it really could have a big effect on her um, in the sense of if anybody um, a lot of Bernie Sanders are definitely going to see it and it will definitely get pushed around um, and then also I've noticed with uh, Bill Bill's and getting in more and more mistresses are coming out. This is the Energizer. She's not coming out to say anything. She actually denies it, but this has like already been claimed, and Secret Service has claimed th this. That's her nickname for her. Um, so I could easily see um, something happening to either one of the Clintons. Um, yeah, and Trump just said that uh, Bill ra like raped women, or that he you know whatever he referenced that he did. And um, I could totally see that they take out one of these two to really um, take the public's attention away from other things as a huge distraction. And these guys are so rich in the lawyers and their hookups. No matter what crime it is, they'll end up just getting slaps on the wrist. Like, they're never going to do any actual jail time. And even if there was some type of federal jail time, it would be in one of those federal luxurious resort prisons, you know, where they have gourmet chefs and tennis courts and hot tubs and probably uh, massage therapists and get, like, call girls, you know. Um, and then, you know, and then, like, here's another thing to put out. Uh, that the mainstream media is covering this, though. This is going pretty viral on YouTube. It was just a compilation of... Hillary lying for 13 minutes straight, but there's a ton of these videos out there. But the fact that the mainstream media is promoting these and picking them up is uh, definitely showing you that they're they're trying to either go with the public or they're trying to just say, okay, it's time. Like they know it's about time to pull the pull the trigger on it. Um, also, you have the 28 pages that could be possibly released in the next month, so that's something to keep an eye on, whether or not what distractions come in. Um, then I want to cover, um, if you remember my other video, if you haven't, go check it out. But Kanye West clearly practices Jumantria. He tweeted out uh, to Zuckerberg, Oh, I'm 53 million in debt, dude, can you help me? And it's even said, it's logical, why didn't... He go through Facebook. Why would he use Twitter when uh, Zuckerberg's Facebook? But the reason why he used 53, Zuckerberg is 53. Okay? That's why he, 53 million. Guaranteed he's not that exact in amount in debt. And if he even is in debt. You know, he probably isn't in debt at all. But here's the thing that will show you that they play this game and they totally know the Gematria. Kanye West is on the Ellen Show and he has an epic, epic rant about Zuckerberg and why he asked him for the 53. Well, what, is, what do they do in the Daily Mail? They cut it down to exactly 53 seconds. They don't. Nobody knows that Zuckerberg's Jumatri is 53. N nobody in the public. They know it. That's why they did it. And it just, it's just like, why is this even a big deal at all? And then you got to listen to this, because Kanye is so damn ridiculous. Even though I have had dinner with him and his wife and told him about how I wanted to help the world, and he said he'd help me, and then I, blah, blah, blah. And like, that's how it feels, though, you know. Yeah, he wanted I to help the world. That if I had more resources, I could help more people. I have ideas. I could help that them. That can make the human race existence within our hundred years better the exact oh god of, uh, emotion and color palette and sonics and everything that i put into my music i put them into the shoes he's talking about and magic worked. and it worked the magic and it worked yeah he's gonna make the world better by making ma magical shoes with us with all his uh his uh <laughs> different god this is just so stupid but just showing you, it's proof. If you don't get it that they they practice gematria, if you don't start seeing the numbers, 
That's all it is. Once you start to pick up on a few of the main numbers, you'll see it all over the place. And if you haven't seen 42 in movies, just start thinking about 42 in movies. It is all over the fucking place, 42 in movies. Like, always when there's a number. It's And it's just, it's just part of the coding. A lot of people have different ideas where the 42 comes from. Um, it's definitely a, a big number in masonry. There's gematria with it. Um... Was I think it's fr uh, I have to double check, but um, uh, but I know it's like the forty second verse of Revelations is all about when um, the devil will get control over the earth or whatever. Uh, I hate using the word devil or any any of the words that they try to label um, the like the most evil entity that people think of. Uh, you know, like none of those words were the real people, but whatever. That's another time. All right. Peace out. Aloha. Have a wonderful day. Take care of yourself.